front where it says aims real big. Well, I made it out. We're at the brand new Meyer here in Warren, Niles, Howland, whatever you want to call it. We're out here at the brand new Meyer that used to be the old Super Kmart. And as a matter of fact, not just any old Super Kmart, it was the very last Super Kmart that was open. It closed in 2018, early 2018. It was really sad because I really liked this store and I made a lot of friends because of this place. Uh, but it closed due to uh, the bankruptcy issue with uh, Kmart and Eddie Lampert's uh, world's longest liquidation. Um, but they closed that in 2018. This is grand opening day today on May 16th, 2023. And even though you're seeing this a day after, that's the best I could do because I had to wait till after work to get here. They raised the old Kmart building and built a brand new building for Meyer from the ground up. And some people were asking in the past, why wouldn't they just use the Kmart building? It wasn't in that bad of shape. Well, I actually know the answer for that. The reason was they had done this with a few other Super Kmarts. Meyer is a Michigan-based company, uh, family-run. They're not corporate-owned, thankfully. And they have stores all throughout Michigan, Ohio, Indiana, Kentucky, and, well, they tried it. They tried retrofitting Super Kmarts, and they actually learned that it was cheaper to just raise the building and build one from the ground up to their liking and their specifications. So that's okay with me. It's weird to be back here, but off camera, I'd been here couple of dozen times anyway I'd say you know aside from Kmart being open being closed being demolished I watched this one start getting built and now here I am for opening day so what are we doing hanging outside let's go in there and see what's good and plus I have to pick up some things anyway and then when I'm done with that I can do something at this store that I couldn't do when this was Kmart Supercenter I can go over there and get gas only certain Kmart's had gas stations, the K-Express, but not many. But most Myers have a gas station. This is one of them. The one in Boardman does not, but this one does, and that's awesome. So we can get gas over there. It's only $3.49 or $3.45 right now, I think. Anyway, we can do that when we're done checking out this brand new store. Okay, now before we go inside, people always ask me, why do you park all the way at the end of the parking lot of these places when you do videos? I answered that once before, but the other reason is to do uh, thumbnails, and then I just leave the car there. But in this case, I moved the car forward because I didn't feel like walking a mile back to the vehicle. But anyway, how about this? What are the odds of this on grand opening day? Getting VIP parking here right in the front row by the main entrances. Yeah, I'll take that. That's really cool. And actually, I get a pretty cool thumbnail, too. Well, I'm not going to use that for the video, but pretty cool picture. And here it is right here. All right, now that we've done that, enough lollygagging. Let's go in there and check it out. All right, let's do it. Wow, this place is nice. Very, very nice. Wow, we. They're having grand opening specials too, I imagine. Earn 6,000 points when you make three produce department purchases of $20. Very cool. Anyway, let's go take a walk around this joint. This place smells so clean, because it is, and because it's brand new. And they've not even been open for 24 hours yet. They've only been open for about 14. They opened up at 6 a.m. And here it is about 8 o'clock in the evening now. Very deep store. It's a lot deeper than the Kmart was.
I'm surprised it's not busier than I than I expected. I expected it to be a, on the busy side for sure. But not so much. Wow, this is a really nice store. They have a big main aisle here in the center of the mall. Mall, listen to me, store. Oh, and before I go too far, I saw that they had this in stock here. They had it listed on uh, Facebook that they just got Penguin City Beer in a local brewery from Youngstown, Ohio, supporting the local businesses. Anyway, let's take a walk down this main corridor here in the middle. Very awesome. I'll have to probably talk a lot because of the music and how loud it is just so we don't get copyright crap. You know how that works on here all the time. Because YouTube is garbage for that. Here, we're going to switch sides too. Look at that. Real nice and easy. <laughs> There's no way I can avoid people in the videos. It's going to happen today, unfortunately. Switching back and forth, left and right. Wow, look at the size of that pet shop. That is cool. Very cool. Wide aisles, well lit. Well stocked, too dropping stuff <laughs> let's take a walk back here i'm just trying to make it thorough if i possibly can <laughs> everybody here is so nice by the way too i had to cut the camera when i first walked in because i was greeted by somebody uh, i think it was the manager that was welcoming us to the store and i mean all he did was give us a store map which was fine. Very cool. So that's our electronics department straight ahead. Then we go into toys, sporting goods. I'm sure any Hot Wheels cars that they had in are all gone. All the good ones I'm sure are gone by now. Treasure hunts and all. Then we're going into the seasonal department. On my left and look at all the summer goodies that they have here. Oh, yeah, they have a lot. Look at that. I like that for starters. The welcome lake house. Very cool. Yeah, but a nice layout. Just as nice as all the other locations are. All right, continuing on. Oh, wow, they got a lot of patriotic gear, too, for Fourth of July, Memorial Day. Oh, that's awesome. I'd have to do a separate video just for that alone. <laughs> Might have to do that. Seems like a good idea. <laughs> wow. Now let's take a look at the health and wellness area, HBA. The pharmacy is over that way. And now we'll go take a walk through the front, back towards the grocery section side of the store. This is great. I know the people of Howland are happy to have this after Kmart closed. Yeah, they had to live a few years without anything other than Walmart and Target, but now they have a nice new option. And quite frankly, if you've ever been to a Meyer, I think you would understand that these happen to be the best, in my opinion. Everybody's entitled to their opinion. But this place is great. And, it, and this is how cool Meyer is. They even give you gift cards here. They sell them, and they sell them for their competition. Ballsy of them, but hey, whatever. All the aisles look fantastic. And Meyers usually keep their stores kept up very nicely to begin with. 
I've never really been to one that wasn't in good shape. They kind of always are. Lots of summery clothes, too. I like it a lot. Big clothing department, too. Very, very spacious in here. Very nicely done. There's another look at the wellness area. Matter of fact, let's take a walk back here. Why not? Try to be as thorough as I possibly can. It's hard. Especially when there's a lot of people in here shopping. And I'm sorry that I have to keep blabbering and blabbering, but because of the overhead music, if I don't, I'll get a copyright claim. And that's no good. Because I put a lot of work into making these fun videos for y'all to enjoy. Helps pay for gasoline in the car and helps keep me fed. We'll take a walk back here. What the heck? And then once I'm done with this video, I actually have some things I have to purchase. So They have a garden center, but I don't believe it's open quite yet. They just have emergency exit only, but they do have flowers and all kinds of things out there. Or it might be closed for the night, possibly. All right, let's take a walk back here. We had to wait for some people to pass through. That's to be expected. My God, the TVs are so loud. They have a lot of TVs and I have to keep talking once again because of the music. Because they have Imagine Dragons playing on one TV. <laughs> Wow. That's loud, too. It might not sound loud on camera, but it is. Oh, they got fish. Oh, we got to check out the fishies. Why not? Look at them all. Clean tanks, too. Very clean tanks. Large assortment of fish. And I've been noticing while I was walking around the store so far that they do have limited time sales. The grand opening sales because they're only from today until Saturday. Oh, they have beta. I love beta. I want to get another one. Wow, look at this one here with the blue and the red on it. Oh, is that cool? Really like that one there. I like them all, but I really like the colors on that one a lot. Even this one here, look at the blue on, on that. That's really cool. They have little tablets, like that one there, that are the price checkers. Very wide aisles. I know Kmart wasn't too bad for that, but this one is fantastic. This is the busiest part of the store, the grocery section. Not shocked at all, honestly. <laughs> But, yeah, that's a that's a big tour through the store here. I'm still not done. I'm still trying to show you as much as I possibly can. Taking a look down the aisles here a little bit, just trying to glance through them. The adult beverage section. I have cookware that I just passed. Appliances. We're coming up on bed and bath here in just a moment. Great addition to the area. Happy to have them here. Now Meyer just needs to move into the Pittsburgh area, and I would be a very happy camper because I wouldn't have to drive an hour to Boardman or the extra 20 minutes on top of that to come to this one. I mean, I still will, but it's just easier that way less gasoline too. Here's their shoe department. Last time I was in a Kmart or even a Sears, the shoe department was pitiful. But that's their own fault though. And I've bought shoes at Meyer before. Very comfy. And they have the big name brands. They have some good stuff here. Clothing's good. I bought some clothes here before too and I actually have to buy socks while I'm here. Might as well while I'm here. 
We have 40% off purses right now. Here's a walk down infant clothing, infant department. We're actually heading towards the men's department now. Obviously, it's impossible to show you everything here because this is a massive store. But I'm trying to do the best I can. Uh, and just for my boss, because my boss really loves Ohio State sarcasm. That's for you, Dan. <laughs> he is not an Ohio State fan. <laughs> Check out these summery shirts here. These are cool. I like that with the sailboats on it. I like this one more, honestly. That's pretty sweet. But yep, men's clothing department. Oh, and they actually have the shorts that I'm wearing. I got the Dickies uh, cargo shorts. They have them here. They are $29.99. At first I thought they were on sale, but that's for the sheet, the uh, t-shirts. All right, well, I've tried to show you around the store as much as I can, but now I need to do some shopping. Really like that, though, the store map and the uh, current flyer. This is cool. Really happy this is here. We have another one in my area now. Boardman's closer, obviously, so I'll still go there more often, but I couldn't pass up the opportunity to stop here in this brand new, built from the ground up location on the basically the uh, land that the Super Kmart once sat. New life, new jobs, new opportunities here. Fantastic, new options now for everybody out here, so glad to have Meyer here. Yep, nice plants here too. Figured I'd show that to you real quick. Then they even have their own like little cafe area with a soda fountain, a Coca-Cola freestyle machine, a icy machine. And then, yeah, restrooms and customer service are up this way. I just had to get a hand basket. Now I'm going to do my shopping. Now, I've been hearing the sounds of fireworks shooting off in the background. And I have to say, I know Meyer's cool and all, but I mean, you didn't have to put on a fireworks show. Kind of makes me want to go outside to see it. But I need some shopping. I need to get done, and I'm hungry, so I'm probably going to go to Permanis after this right over at the mall. But, oh, wow, look at that. <laughs> Love that toasted towel. <laughs> the camping ones are so cool. But, no, I do have some shopping I need to do, and I'm just kidding about the fireworks. I don't know if there's a special event going on in town or not, but... It's too coincidental to have them on the grand opening day, which is May 16th. So unless something happened in town, I'm just going to assume that Meyer has fireworks tonight. Wishful thinking anyway, right? Yeah, I like those towels a lot. Yeah, that's really cool. All right, everyone. Well, that's going to wrap up this initial trip to the new Warren Meyer. And I actually refer to it as the Warren Meyer inside of the store. So anyway, that was fun. I got a lot of things that I needed, including a lot of groceries that I've been needing for a while. So that was a good excuse to wait and come out here and get them while things are on sale and on special for the rest of the week. Very awesome store. Thank you, Meyer, for coming to Warren, Ohio. Thank you for coming to Boardman as well. Now just come to Pittsburgh. Anyway, thanks for watching, everybody. Hope you enjoyed this new store tour. Was really happy to do it for you. And while now my belly is rumbling, I'm very hungry. And there's a Permanis on the other side of this building right at the mall. That's calling my name. So I think it's time for a Pittsburgher. Anyway, I'll talk to you guys. Oh, and a beer. So I'll talk to you guys later. Thanks for watching, everybody. Take care and stay awesome. Thank you, Meyer. Love this store.